Look at my set vloggy. Okay, ready? One, two, three. We, we got, got a puppy! puppy. <laughs> so over the last weekend, we got our new family member, and he's the cutest, he's the fluffiest, he's three months old. I will introduce him to you guys at the end of this video, but first I wanted to show you guys what we've been up to over the last week. taking me 35 years to fill this cup of water or any cup of water because my fridge freaking sucks right now I don't know what happened but somehow the water pressure of like the water dispenser just became hella slow so now this is what it looks like I do not have the patience for this those times were hard and all I did was resent you oh no I don't want to go back what? You actually do. Why? <laughs> you do have school, but what? <laughs> you don't want to go to school? No, you're not going, and that's my fault because I woke up really, really tired this morning. Can you bring me your hairbrush? Says I with this hair right now. <laughs> I literally just got up from my bed. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning, and I couldn't wake up this morning. I feel like the time change is really, really getting to me. Time changed this weekend, so we lost an hour. See, I want, I want, I want a chocolate. I want chocolate milk. You want chocolate milk? Yeah, I want chocolate milk. I want the chocolate milk. I want chocolate milk. I'm feeling like it's Halloween today. Stop moving. Hello. I am. Baby. I heard it. Baby, stop moving. I heard it, blog. Stop. No, you didn't. Your hair's already growing now. I don't even know how to brush it anymore. I, I woke up so sleepy. You woke up so sleepy? Yeah. What's wrong? Your phone always goes like run and drown. <laughs> and I just like, I'm just like so tired. My alarm is Kylie Jenner's uh, waking up stormy like the whole meme I haven't changed it since and it's so annoying and it scares me every morning it just goes rise and shine and he's so funny for just pointing that out rise and shine rise and shine so annoying so yeah I gotta change that alarm I was saying that it was daylight savings time and we lost an hour overnight even though i prefer this time of year i prefer it this way the sun goes down later like the days feel longer but yeah the time change is just really messing me up so this morning i just couldn't wake up and i was like not is not gonna go to school today i'm gonna sleep in and now i'm like to the gym i have my personal training session in like about an hour and i haven't even made breakfast today i'm making eggs in my little waffle maker my very tiny tiny waffle maker waffle maker <laughs> It truly is revolutionary. Ooh, this world accused me for my thousand crimes. I've left in shame my soul. But you tell me the truth. I'm so happy with you. Now I want to do good. Cause I've been acting like that when my girl on the floor is your fault. Do you think I'm weird? Do you, do you think I'm weird? Stop it. Stop. Come. <laughs> I want to go to sleep. You want to go to sleep? Okay, yeah. I'm just going to leave you in the car, all right? All right, bye. Boom. Ah! <laughs> I shaked you. Come on. So I went to the gym and I got home. I was like, I should go like 
take pictures of myself somewhere because I haven't posted on Instagram in like two weeks or something. I don't know. I'm always posting on my stories, but my my Instagram like feed, I'm like so I get so much anxiety posting. So I'm like, I'm gonna go take a picture today, but I feel ugly. Look at me. I just brushed out my hair, that's why it's super like extra frizzy. So I'm gonna straighten my hair. I'm gonna do something fun. Actually, probably nothing fun. I don't know what to do with my hair anymore. Basically, what I'm trying to say is that we're gonna fix this. Maybe I'll put on a cuter outfit. Who knows? Okay, I'm in the middle of doing my makeup and usually I would pick an outfit before I do my makeup. Today, I decided I'm gonna match my outfit to my makeup because I just found the coolest freaking eyeshadow ever. It is this pinkish purple eyeshadow by Rare Beauty and it's like holographic. I haven't finished my makeup. I literally just put that on and I think it looks so cool. I literally just couldn't, I couldn't get like a good video of the eyeshadow. My bathroom lighting is so bad, but <laughs> I'm cringing so hard at these like clips of my eye. I just really wanted to show you guys that this is the Magnetic Spirit Palette by Rare Beauty. Hi, baby. Hey, Do you want spaghetti? Oh, you lost your arms? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Do you want spaghetti? Yeah. Actually, no, because I can't. Because you can't eat it because you don't have arms. Yeah. Because I just did my makeup, my hair. I put on a cute outfit and I ended up going nowhere. I just sat in my bed for like two hours. I'm so exhausted from this daylight savings that like, I'm just like, I can't. Today I can't. Maybe tomorrow I will. I'm stressing out. I'm gonna throw up. Good morning. I just signed up for the Bad Bunny shoe drop, the Adidas Bad Bunny collaboration. And so I registered for it. It's a draw which gives me so much anxiety because the timeline is like an hour and a half from the moment that I registered to when they start drawing the winners of this shoe thing. And I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky. I woke up Monday morning and I was like, I'm gonna have the best week of my life. Why? Because I said so. And now I'm like waiting. It is 11 in the, it's 11 15. Um, the registration started at 10 o'clock in the morning. So you know I was there at 10 o'clock in the morning. I don't even know my size. I picked up women's five and a half. I don't know. I made my lady sign up for it too with my size. <laughs> um, so here we are. Hopefully I get it. I'm just distracting myself. I wanted to go to the beach today by myself, but I just didn't plan ahead, so. I get the urge to go to the beach like very randomly and I'm very, very lucky to live very close to the beach. It's already 11 in the morning. I have to get my from school in a few hours, so I'm not gonna do that. Instead, I'm gonna do what I said I was gonna do yesterday and take pictures for Instagram because, I don't know, I'm, I'm feeling better. Even if I don't get it, I'm feeling good, but I am gonna get the shoes. Ooh! Okay, so I'm just gonna get ready and do my hair, my makeup, find a cute outfit get out of this house. There's only 15 minutes left. I actually wanted to stretch this morning, but I was paralyzed in my bed. Like, will I get the shoes? Will I get the shoes? Oh my God, it's so hot in here. I feel like I'm on my grind again. That's cringe to say, but I am starting to go to the gym like as often as I used to, and I'm so excited to go to the gym every day. I feel like that's how it should be. I also do know that in order to get to the point where you are so excited about going to the gym, you have to force yourself to go. It's okay to miss a workout every now and then. I try not to beat myself up over it, but I feel like you're not gonna wake up and be like, yay, gym, if you're not used to going to the gym. It is like a process to get to that mental state where you're like, yes, let's go to the gym. So your mentality kind of has to change. You're, you have to be like, hey, I get to work out. My body allows me to work out, so I might as well just get myself there. If you think about it too much, you're not going to go. So you need to just get up and go to the gym. I promise you, once you're there and you get your workout done, you're going to feel so good that you went. So yeah, I go through my stages where I'm like, gym, 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 gym. And then I'm like, Ugh, exhausted. I don't want to go. I miss like two weeks of the gym. I go like twice in those two weeks. But I always make sure I come back stronger and better than ever. And that's my gym rant. I didn't get the shoes, but I did get a fat ass. I'm just kidding, I didn't get that either. It's okay, nothing can ruin my... <laughs> Nothing's gonna ruin my day. I'm hungry, so I'm gonna eat something. I'm like a little bit hungry, but like not hungry hungry, so... 
I don't know. Here's a hack for you guys. If you are in a rush and you're hungry but you don't want to make anything, plant-based yogurt and a protein cookie. This is the Lenny and Larry's protein cookie. I don't like eating this by itself. I feel like it tastes very crumbly, but I do like putting it in my yogurt. I also don't really like yogurt by itself, so perfect match because I really like this combination. I usually just eat half the cookie in my yogurt because I feel like the full thing is just too much. And my yogurt is plant-based. Um, I don't like to consume dairy, only on special occasions, and it'll be like ice cream or cheese or something. I don't like cow's milk. Very, very bad for my stomach. Dairy, just in general. I'm lactose intolerant. That's too much information. This is the So Delicious Coconut Milk Yogurt, but I prefer the Kite Hill Almond Milk Yogurt. They were just out of it at the grocery store. Also, look at these cute little bowls that I got at Target. I also got the matching plates and the matching cups. That's the color of the season. So, I just take half the cookie and I crumble it in here, like so. And then I mix it up, like that, and then I eat it. Um, so the plan was to go somewhere by myself and get cute and take a picture, but I decided I could just take a picture in my house. So that's what I did. I already posted them on my Instagram. I took a picture in my bathing suit. Every time I post in my bathing suit, which has been like twice, I want to throw up everywhere and delete the picture immediately. And yes, I am wearing the same shirt I was wearing yesterday because I own it. In the meantime, I have to go get my child and I think I'm gonna take him to get a smoothie because I want a smoothie. Don't vlog him. Don't vlog you, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He's so sleepy. He just got out of school, so I understand. But I brought him to get a smoothie. He's like, why can't you just go by yourself? Because I can't leave you in the car, silly. I came to Wayside Market here in Pinecrest, Miami, Florida. I've never been here before, but I heard that it's really, really good. Like, the smoothies are really good, so we'll see what all the hype is about. You like your popsicle? Mm -hmm. I'll go up there for a popsicle. I got a strawberry shake. Can I try? It's really good. Are you done yet? Mark? <laughs> Here. Okay, you're here. You made it. You want to see my puppy? He is a male Aussie Poo. He's three months old. Aussie Poo being Australian Shepherd and Poodle Mix. He's also a mini, but Ginger's a standard Labradoodle, so she's freaking huge. He's gonna be like 15 to 20 pounds. Ginger's about like 50 pounds right now, I think. I don't know. We have a vet appointment tomorrow for both of them. And I'll talk more about him in my next vlog and just go into like them meeting and like everybody's reactions. But I just wanted to introduce him and tell you guys his name. What if I fart and then I blast off all the <laughs> Ew, Ginger farted. <laughs> Ew. I was talking about farts. <laughs> yeah, you were. <laughs> this is our new puppy. What's his name, Mateo? Disco butt. Click on thumbs up. No, I'm thumbs down. Exactly. <laughs> this is Disco and he's the cutest. And we will update you guys on our next video. We'll give you all the info. Ginger meeting him and I love you, vlog. I love you guys. Bye! He said <laughs> Oh. He oh. said he loves the vlog. He does. <laughs> Family. Ginger! Family group. A uh, group, group of family hug. Um, a family hug. Uh, a uh, family hug. We got it. Bye, Augie. Okay.